What is going on guys, DeviousMarine38 here, and I'm going to be bringing you guys some videos um, about the new Vengeance map pack um, covering zombies and multiplayer. And most of these videos are from Syndicate and some other YouTubers, so I'm not going to um, put their links in the description because they're pretty popular and you can just search them to find their channels if you're not subscribed already. So um, anyway, hope you guys enjoy these videos and uh, be sure to subscribe because I will be posting videos in a month's time when they come out for PS3. So that's it guys, hope you guys enjoy, hit that like button, be sure to comment and subscribe, and I'll see you guys later. Hey guys, it's Syndicate here, and today I'm going to be showing you the Paralyzer and the Pack-A-Punch version of it. Now, the Pack-A-Punch version is so much more efficient, and it's kind of obvious. You get an awesome gun, you want to Pack-A-Punch it and make the Petrifier. Now, this gun is awesome. On the Ghost, it just holds them beat. It doesn't actually kill them, uh, but if you know you get a group of them like the actual Paralyzer does in the first place, holds them back and gives you a bit of an advantage to be able to sneak through the house and not get hit by a them taking loads of points off you. On the zombies, it's really effective as it still slows down the zombies, but it's so much more powerful and it takes out the zombies a lot quicker. Now, there's cool little features about this gun, like how you can see I've just slowed down the zombies. I can slow down the big guy if I do choose to do so, but you can take out huge waves of it. Now, this gun is literally like a pause and just get out of jail free card. As you saw there, I just used it and walked past the zombies. Like, you could use a ray gun, you could use whatever gun you wanted as your main primary weapon, swap to this and then just walk past them, it's absolutely easy. If you've got a tricky situation, then you're absolutely fine. And something that I would suggest is if, if you're probably going to go through going high rounds on this map, then get stamina up because you see how quickly I sprint with this, you see how fast my gun picks up, how much faster you handle the actual, you know, the paralyzer. So when it's Pack-A-Punch, the Petrifier, you know, it's a big, heavy, sloggy gun. So when you have stamina up, you sprint, you pick up, you know, you swap weapons, everything is a lot faster. So I'd really recommend getting stamina up. I'm also going to do a video now. You can click on the screen to see how I actually got five perks. Um, it was actually a cool little uh, mistake, but it turned out I found out how to do it. So guys, thank you for watching. Make sure you leave a like rating. I hope you're enjoying the new map, and I'll see you guys in my next video. Adios. Wow.